In this video, we will find the integral of 1 upon x square square root of x square minus 1 with respect to x. So, first of all, we can take x square common inside the square root. So, we have 1 minus 1 upon x square. we will apply square root on both the factors so we have square root of x square multiply by square root of 1 minus x square and the square root of x square is x so x time x square is x cube so we have x cube multiply by 1 minus 1 upon x square dx. And now we will suppose that the inside of the square root is u. So let u is equal to 1 minus 1 upon x square. Now we will find the differential du which is the derivative of this thing multiplied by dx. First of all, we have to find the derivative of x to the power minus 2, which is minus 2 times x to the power minus 3. So, the derivative of 1 is 0 and the derivative of 1 upon x square, which is x to the power minus 2 is this. So, minus times minus is plus. So, we have 2 upon x cube dx. Now we can see that the above integral can be written as integral of 1 upon square root of 1 minus 1 upon x square multiply by 1 upon x cube dx and here we have du upon 2 is equal to 1 upon x cube dx. So we can put du upon 2 in place of 1 upon x, is x cube dx and we will put u inside the square root. So the above integral, suppose the above integral is i, so the above integral i will become one upon the square root of u u upon 2. Now this can be written as half integral of u raised to the power minus 1 upon 2 du and here we will apply the power rule of integration. So we have 1 upon 2 u raised to the power 1 upon 2 plus 1 and in the denominator we have the same thing. So this can be written as half u raised to the power 1 upon 2 whole upon 1 upon 2 plus c. Now half and half can be cancelled. So we have u raised to the power 1 upon 2 plus c. Now integral is square root of u plus c. Now we will put the value of u which is 1 minus 1 upon x square plus c and this will become x square minus 1 upon x square plus c and then square root of x square minus 1 upon square root of x square plus c. So the final answer is square root of x square minus 1 upon x plus c. So this is the answer of the given integral. 